So here is my uh, uh, piment plant absolutely infested by aphid. If you can see it, you see there are the flowers they are everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. You can see some shells of them. And why is it difficult to kill the aphid? Is because they stay just behind the leaves, so it's really difficult. You can see there, maybe. And um, so that's really that's really annoying. It's a beautiful uh, uh, plant, but uh, yeah, very difficult to get rid of them. Very fit in this plant. Um, we will try to harvest the fruit and uh, and uh, see if we can eat them. Don't think it's a really big problem, but uh, yeah, we will have to get rid of this plant. It's absolutely uh, not possible to to continue with that. So I wanted to show you. So I tried the holes on this one, and and uh, you can see on the ground dead things. I have to clean um, all around. Of course, uh, I did it uh, two days ago. Yeah. So uh, I, I will show you uh, my balcony, my salon, and that's the rest, <laughs> the rest of my Persil, Persil after uh, the invasion <laughs> of of uh, aphids again and that's the rest also of my uh, uh, celery uh, and it grew back because uh, I, I did the treatment uh, two weeks ago and it's much better now but uh, really not so good yeah so I bought something it's a person and uh, it's fresh it has no aphids I check it out I can't show you because of course it's too difficult to film but so far it's good so I will put it close to the to the piment plant I will do it right away we see and we wait we will wait sorry uh, to get some visitors around it ah that's a shame but I I do it for for, for the beauty of uh, of the essential oils so let's see um, I will wait one day I think they will be covered with uh, a and uh, then I will do the treatment and let's see what will happen.